close to playoffs and then to win them was big. Um, super happy for the players because they, uh, they put a lot of work in to, to get this far. And as far as this weekend, we're extremely excited. I think we're um, playing well at the right time and, and peaking at the right time. So it uh, should be exciting. We're just going to go ahead and play our game and, and force, force teams to you know, maybe adapt to us. Uh, we're peaking at the right time, and uh, I think we're really going into this weekend very confident. Leanne Sanderson's been on a tear. She's been playing extremely well. Uh, Haley Siegel, uh, Michaela Howe, looking forward to getting some goals from her this weekend. And, and really, our, our entire back four has been defending well. So uh, it's been going good for us. Personal side, you're up for Coach of the Year. Do you have, uh, how do you feel about awards and that sort of thing? Um, it's, it's definitely an honor to be uh, put, put uh, up there with the best coaches in W League. But really, the important thing for me is to just go, go up to Canada this weekend and come back with a championship. Joanna, you've been, uh, you've been in some pretty big games before in your life. And um, how does this compare in, in what you've been through in the past? And how are you looking forward to this weekend? I am really looking forward to this weekend. We're on a 10-hour bus trip, at least, up to Ottawa for the final four of the North American W League Championships. And I'm really, really excited. I think as a team, we've come really far from day one until now. And it's so great to have a core group of players here on the bus with us. Um, we're bonding over Olympic soccer and iPhones. And so it's been a great trip so far. And um, I think once we get on the soccer fields, we'll realize the impact that this game can have on the club or a second-year team. So to uh, reach this point has been quite the accomplishment, but um, we're not happy with just getting to Ottawa. We want to win the entire thing, and I think we have a great mix of veteran players and young players to really take the championship home back to D.C. Big games um, when it comes to the college Final Fours or um, WPS championships. It's, there's a lot of nerves that comes with playing in a, a large match that determines a championship game. So for the young players, I would just say, you know, it's, it's all about having fun and it's, it's still the game of soccer. It's no different. And remember why you've gotten to this point and why you're such a great team because it doesn't change overnight and doesn't change because you're in a big game. W League, you know, what's your experience been like so far? It's been really great. Even from day one when I got on this team, the, the team's been so welcoming and just so friendly, and they're really willing to bring the younger players under their wing and just kind of make us all a unified team. And so it's been a really positive experience for me. At the end of the summer, did you think when you looked on the calendar that you'd be here now in the championship? I did not, actually. I remember clicking tentative on the uh, availability form, just knowing that it's really close to my preseason for school and everything. And so... Um, I didn't think that we'd make it this far initially, but then after playing with the team and just seeing us grow and get better every day and every day, it really started to become a, a reality for us. And so uh, the closer we got, the more it became more at the forefront of my mind and really hoping that we'd be able to go to Ottawa and kind of make a difference for this club and for women's soccer in general. Um, it's, it's very different from my college experience because, well, probably just because it's my first year and just kind of getting into a new kind of system, a new style. But I think that's probably the biggest beneficial part of this team is the, d the different experience that I'm able to kind of take away. Harder shots, playing with older players who have more experience and like how they handle themselves in training and in games and in travel and all these kind of situations are really going to help me, I think, develop my game further. Okay. When you were 21, yeah. if there was a 30-year-old player, you know, think about what could they have told you that would make something like this easier on you when you were that young? I'd probably call them a grandma. <laughs> <laughs> Ha 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 